Hello friends, welcome to the DJ Voice channel. You all have come here with the latest and important updates. So the friend will watch the video till the end. And if you are new to the channel, then you must subscribe to the channel. You will subscribe and click on the bell option given. Along with it, thousands of migrant workers are at risk of exploitation because of multiple failures in the government scheme that allows them to come to the UK. A report has found the way the Home Office has set up the employer sponsorship system to replace freedom of movement. After Brexit has prioritised immigration control over workers' rights, according to the report, systematic drivers of migrant worker exploitation in the UK. From the Work Rights Centre, movement after Brexit has prioritised immigration control over workers' rights, according to the report. Systematic drivers of migrant worker exploitation in the UK. From the Work Rights Centre, it analysed 40 cases of migrant workers at risk of exploitation, along with documents connected with their cases. According to the latest government figures in the year ending June 2023, 321,000 work visas were granted, a 45% increase on the previous year. The exploitation of migrant workers is no coincidental but the outcome of a system, an inadequate and increasingly hostile national policy environment, the report said. Some workers are scammed in their home countries by agents who charge them tens of thousands of pounds to organise their visas to the UK and secure an employer sponsor to give them a job. They can find themselves in a catch-22 situation where they pay a vast sum of money for a visa and a job package but when the promised job fails to materialise, they are fearful of reporting the employer to officials in case the employer sponsorship. Registration is cancelled by the by the Home Office, leading to their visa being voided. Some, therefore, feel they have no alternative but to accept being exploited or to take on risky and precarious. Cash-in-hand jobs. One Indian nurse is currently stranded in the UK with her partner and young child after paying £20,000 to an agent in her home country. The agent promised to secure a UK work visa for her and find her secure employment here. 